Hey everyone, Akshay here and you're watching TechBinders. So Samsung has recently launched the 5 beta updates for its 2017 flagship phones that is S8 and S8 Plus. So if you want to enjoy the 5 beta membership, you need to register on Samsung members app. Well, the registrations got closed pretty fast and a lot of people are left without even registering and they are not able to enjoy the 5 beta updates. So after a week launch of first 5 beta update, they have launched the second 5 beta update on 24 Jan. And it has fixed a lot of bugs, but still there are a lot of bugs left on the Pi Beta update for S8 and S8 Plus. Well, I hope they will be fixed in the stable version of Android Pi. And if you are not knowing, the launch date of S8 and S8 Plus Pi Beta update has been shifted from March to Feb. So now you will be able to get the stable beta update in Feb, which you were getting in March. So I think the second beta update will be the last beta update. And in Feb, they will launch the stable version. So they are working on the stable version right now. So if you already updated the first beta update and I've checked myself, I haven't got the notification for the second beta update. And even when I go to the settings and software update, I cannot find the second beta update. And it shows that I am having the latest beta update and that is the first beta update. So I searched on the internet a little bit and I found that a lot of people are facing the same issues. Even they have downloaded and registered on the Samsung members still they are not able to enjoy the second beta update. So here in this video, I'm gonna tell you how you can enjoy the second beta update and if you're not having any idea what is going on here, go and check that video out on the card and there you will find out how you can install the Android Pi beta update on your phone. So without any further ado, let's get started in this video. To enjoy this update, you need to have an SD card and you need to download and update. Well, the size of this update is around 535 MB. So you need to download the update. The link will be in the description from where you can download it. Just move it to the SD card as I've done and you need not to worry about anything else. Turn off your device so that you can install this update. Well, the process remains same as we have done for the first update. Press the power button, big speed button and volume up button at the same time. You need to enter into the recovery mode, just press and hold it for a couple of seconds and you will find that you are in the recovery mode. It will show no command, just press and hold the power up button and the Bixby button for some more time. And here we are. So it shows a couple of options like reboot system, reboot to bootloader. Just go and click on apply update from SD card. For entering just press the power button and you will hear. So here is the update that is ZSA5 ZSC. You can name it to any file whatever you want according to your choice and just hit the power button once again and you will find here that it is applying the updates. As you can see on your screen this phone is applying the updates. So you need to wait for a couple of minutes and you will find that you will be updated with the Pi Beta version 2 and it will fix all the bugs that you are facing in the Pi Beta version 1. So it has applied the beta version 2 and let's check out whether the improvements are there in the bug fixing or not. So here you want to find that it takes some more time to optimize the apps and it will make your phone ready to be used after it optimizes all the apps. Base one version has been changed from ZSA5 to ZSAC. So we have successfully installed the software version 2. So I hope you like this video and if this video was helpful give me a thumbs up and if you have not subscribed my channel till yet. Click on the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you can get latest notifications whenever I upload a new video on my channel. And if you are facing any problem, drop your query in the comment section below and I will get up to you. So thank you for watching. Have a nice day. This is Akshay signing out.